Yo, what's up guys, and welcome to part 3 of <coughs> Minecraft Crack Server, how to make Minecraft Crack Server. Um, today it's um, the last resort, um, it's the Hamachi way. Some people might not know, but <coughs> just for the people who knows, who don't know, showing you this, okay? Um, you need a few things for this. Oh, sorry. You need... Log me in Hamachi and craft bucket. Yeah, craft bucket. Yeah, that's it. And then, yeah, first you need to install Hamachi. Download it, which takes a bit of while. Then you run it. Next, I agree. Um, it's your choice for that. <clears throat> Pardon me. Just waiting for it to freaking load. I'll I'll be back. Okay, seems to be loading. Uh, and before they they will do like a permission thingy, and you press yes. Um, otherwise it won't work. And then yeah, you launch it. Start it. Waiting it for it to load. And yeah, and then and then you create a new network. You name it whatever you want. I'll call it. It's just, this is just random and password whatever you want, but make sure your f your friends or whoever the person you want to join um, needs to know the password in my case we'll put one two three oh, already taken I don't know okay so now that's my okay now now you, you can cross cross it but don't completely cross it okay um, and then now now up to the server bit you make a new folder Minecraft server. Oh, I spelled it wrong. Who cares? Um, you drag craft bucket in and rename it to craft bucket. So I'm just moving it so you can see. Craft bucket. Yep. And um, you copy the and then you make a new text file. And then you copy the code that I provide in the description, okay? In my case, mine's 64-bit. Um, copy. Paste. Save. Oh, sorry. Save as. Run dot bat. You make sure you put the dot bat. All files. And save it. If you've done that all right, um, you, you should appear this batch file okay then you run the server or oh. in my case they could not specify the path then you have to remove this then you have to paste the other code okay then it should work Just setting up the spawn area. Okay, once it's done, just type stop. Okay, so um, you press right click on run and then edit. And then, how, how many gigabyte of RAM you want to run it on? In my case, I'll run it on 6,000 megabytes. I'll save it. Now, server properties. Most important thing, change online mode to false. And the rest is all your, up to your choice. Um... 
yeah, um, all your choice, and then you save it. Oh wait, and make sure there's nothing on the IP, okay? Uh, oh wait, yeah, IP. And then you open up Hamachi, then you copy that, you copy it IPv4 into the IP server IP. Then you save it, okay? And then you run the server. The hell, wait. It's running as normal. Wait, sorry. You run the server. Um, I think there's something wrong. Uh, what the hell? Oh wait, I'm so dumb. Wait, I'll just pause it, I'll be Yep, um, yeah, sorry about that. Um, that was just simply a problem that I forgot to put the M. Oh yeah, if it says can't specify path, then you you use the 32-bit one, okay? Um, once that's done, you can join. Um, for your friends to join, uh, your friends have to go to uh, network and go to join existing, and then you type in your network your network ID. So if you want to join mine, you type in Super Danger Gamer 123 and put the password as 123 and then you join. Then once you joined, you use this IP to join the server. Okay, so do example. Oh shoot. Okay, so. I had a server. How much? It, server name doesn't matter. Um, okay, so I need to copy this. Five, sorry. 5.255.74.10. Oh, what the? Great. 5.255.74.10. Okay. Oh, yeah, and also type in 25565. And yeah. Here's my server. Oh, yeah. Um, also, to op yourself, type op in your username. So you can um, break in the spawn area. See? Oh, no, shit. Oh. Okay, so you can still talk and stuff like that. See, um, what? Okay, and yeah. Oh, and one more, one more problem. Make sure you check that your fi firewall is off. Go here and make sure you turn it off. If you don't turn it off, um, then no one can join. Okay. So yeah, that's about it, and yeah, hope this helped, thanks for watching, and if if it work, helped, then give, give this video a thumbs up, say it works, if it doesn't, tell me your problem, um, yeah, and I'll reply to you, okay, thanks for watching, bye.